Hello, my dear listeners. This is Paul, your host at Stories Philippines Podcast, and today I have a spooky tale to share with you. This story was sent in by one of you, and it's about something eerie that happened when they were still in elementary school. Sit back, because this tale will surely send shivers down your spine. Back then, after my house burned down, I lived with my grandmother at my uncle's place, which was near the town center of Bacolod. Right beside the center stood an old, empty library full of unused typewriters, dusty books, and piles of paper. My friends and I often sneaked in to play there. We would type random stuff and role-play as characters from the famous show Encantadia, where Corel was among the stars. One day, as we bored of our typical games, we decided to pick some mangoes. We ventured down a road lined with large, grand houses that strangely seemed deserted. It was a cloudy afternoon, and a light drizzle set a gloomy mood. While collecting mangoes, I noticed something curious at one of the houses. It had a variety of milk and Milo packets displayed outside, which caught our attention because my friends and I loved snacking on them. We all stared, transfixed, and then out of nowhere, we saw a woman standing at the doorway. Her hair was short, she wore a brown top with a short black skirt, and to my horror, I realized she had no face. Frozen with fear, I snapped out of it only when my friends pulled me away to run. Back home, we were all in tears from the chilling sight we could not forget. Later, I told another friend about the incident, and it turned out that their house was near that very spot. But the shocking truth was revealed. There were no houses there. It was all an empty lot for years. Curious and frightened, I tagged along with my classmate to see for myself. To my surprise, where the faceless woman's house had stood, there were only cattle pens. A man was there feeding the cows. I asked him about the big houses, but he said there had never been any. Only the mango tree we had picked from remained. Listeners, this chilling encounter reminds us that sometimes our eyes can deceive us and things aren't always as they seem. Remember to stay curious, but also be cautious because not every adventure leads to a place that should be explored. And sometimes a mystery is best left unsolved. I've got more hair raising experiences to share, but let's save those for another time. Thanks for tuning in and don't forget, stay spooked, but safe.